get to know people before you make your opinion. I'm not my disabilities. I'd love to have a, a girlfriend and get married. Well, your senior year, you got a superlative. Most determined. I heard you did not win most wittiest, and I want to know why you lost that. I think because the people in Florida were in charge of the elections. My name's Aaron, and welcome to the kitchen. Hey, welcome to Crispy King. I get to introduce my good friend Aaron today. He's joining me in the kitchen. We are gonna create a squirrel. It's gonna, squirrel. <laughs> it's gonna be epic and awesome and filled with a bunch of dad jokes. We'll see you in the kitchen. My name is Aaron Johnson. I currently live in Peachtree City. My name, Andy, used to be the area director. I did, with Young Life. We've been friends for 15 years. And we still like each other. I am very goofy. I love people in general. I love jokes. And I'll just read stuff, just, you know, useless trivia stuff. If it's your first time to Cakes and Conversations, welcome. If you'll go ahead and hit that like button, because trust me, you're gonna like everything that Aaron's sharing with us today. Hit the subscribe button, share this with as many people as you can, because we want them to hear Aaron's story. And if you're interested in following us on the social medias, uh, you can click the link below. You can follow us on the Instagram, Facebook, LinkedIn. Call your aunt, call your mom, call your dog, call your neighbor's dog, because it's going down. Yeah, it's going down for real. Yes. Tell me about your memory. About my what? Your memory. Do you have a good memory? That was a joke, by the way. <laughs> no, I, I have a <laughs> terrible short-term memory. Um, but if it gets in my long-term memory, it's there. Why? I couldn't remember what I wore yesterday, or ate, or, but, but I can remember um, going to the ball game with my dad and, and my, my papa, who, who is dead right now. Uh, I mean, you know, so it's frustrating. What else does it make you feel? What was the question again? What else does it make you feel? You said it's frustrating. My memory? Yeah. Issues? Um, sad because, you know, you know, people ask me, you know, to remember stuff. And, and sometimes I can't. Let's get started, Aaron. We're gonna start with the brown part, and that means that we're gonna cut four ounces. There we go. No need for a knife. Now what we need to do is unwrap this butter and place it in here for four ounces. You wanna do that? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna add four ounces. Did I say, why am I saying ounces? Four pounds. If you add four pounds of butter today, trust me, you will appreciate the butter. And you're gonna add four tablespoons of butter, where then we're gonna add a bunch of Rice Krispies, but we're actually gonna start with Cocoa Krispies, which I'm excited about. I usually don't create with Cocoa Krispies. Uh, they're gonna add a nice chocolatey flavor if you like chocolate. Yes. Are you concerned with what other people think? No. Because you don't seem like the type of person who's really concerned with what other people think. I mean, what other people think about you? I don't like it when people stare or, you know. There's a way to ask a question in a nice way, and there's a way to ask the same question in a rude way. Would you agree with that or? Yeah, will you give me an example of maybe one of each? So, you see that I don't have thumbs, right? Right. Well, 
let's pretend that you're not Andy Davenport, my former area director, but you're, you're still a Andy Davenport that sees me at, at a restaurant. This is gonna be hard for you, but in, in this scenario, you're, you, you don't care. You don't care about anybody, okay? So you look at me and say, why do you not have thumbs? That's rude. Yeah. But let's go back to Andy Davenport. You, you've known me for, or I mean, you, you care. You're, you're the area director, or you know, you work with differently in a book kit. Hi, how are you? See, I I'm being you now. Hi, how are you? You know, fit filler. I, I noticed you don't have any thumbs, you know. What's up with that? You just grab the bowl and pour it in. Grab Can I bowl. pour the whole bowl in, please? Without the glass, yes. I, I've, been waiting, I, I've been waiting for this. Um, how mellow are the marshmallows? Uh, I mean, if if you dump me in, in a, a bunch of butter, hot butter, hot butter, I wouldn't be very mellow. If they could talk to us right now, what would they be saying? Ouch! Did you know that the Bible says that, that you are, are supposed to have a Amy's coffee ready in the morning? No, I didn't know that. It's right in the Bible. He brews. What kind of car did the disciples drive? A Honda. They all arrived in one accord. Do you know who the first actor was in the Bible? Samson, he brought the house down. You know I had ADHD, right? Or did you know that? I did not know that. How many kids with ADHD does it take to change a light bulb? Wanna go ride bikes? Why did the squirrel cross the road? It was the chicken's day off. What time do, is the best time to go to the dentist? Tooth hurdy. You heard of the Joseph Sam School? Yeah, tell me about it. I volunteer there and, you know, I, I just try to treat people the way I wanted or want to be treated. You know, I, my idea is always, you know, if I need to know what the student's disability is in order to help them, Tell me, but otherwise they're just, they're a person. How, how do you mix them? I do use my hands now. The butter on my bottom will be a little bit warm. Yeah, but butter on your bottom? <laughs> it's going to be a long day in the kitchen. <laughs> hey, listen, we're not massaging them. <laughs> you did great, man. He probably doesn't remember me. Why not? You're pretty memorable. We only have so many friends who tell bad jokes. I don't believe that. <laughs> All right, you can wash your hands, get the butter off. Mm -hmm. sink over here. I have a, a really funny story about be, being rude. Can I? Oh, please and, tell me. This may or may not have to do with my thumbs, but um, we were actually at, at a Mexican restaurant, my dad and I. I don't know if you know, but, but I know Spanish. Well, the people there didn't know that. But I, I think it was some customers were talking about me in Spanish. And so I just went back. <laughs> They were like, 
Oops. Maybe I picked the wrong, wrong person to mess with. That happens a lot. They, they'll talk about you in front of you, like you're not there. Yeah, it, it makes me feel hurt. Like, they might be the one that's disabled. <laughs> I'm sorry. You did, you did realize what, you're, what you were getting into when you picked me, didn't you? That's why I edit. I love it. <laughs> or, or how much? That much? Huh? Get four, baby. Okay, okay, hang on. You can't stick the bag in there. <laughs> Can you tell me what you're doing right now? You just... Watch this. Can I give you a pointer? Just one. <laughs> yes. All day. All day. Er, day. <laughs> yes. What kind of things do you want people to ask you about? Like, my interests are, are you know... I, 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 I wear... You know, crazy shirt sometimes, and you know that might lead to different things, or you know, hats, and how my day's been. Just normal stuff that you would ask anybody else. I mean, push it down from the side and spin it, and then it all gets on there. Ready? Keep pushing down from the side, lift up. You can't tell me you, you didn't know this was going to be fun when you picked uh, me. Just hours of fun. This is what fun looks like right here. Can I help you with that? Yes. Okay. We're going to go down like this. Oh, let's go down to the river to pray. Singing it about that good old day and who shall wear the rose and crown. Good Lord, show me the way. Show me that you can pour some more. Coke. Keep pouring. No, no, keep pouring. Pour some, some sugar on me. Oh. <laughs> Just a medley. That's a mashup here. Okay. Any reason you Do the match. Do the monster <laughs> match. The monster match. Hey, pour some more Rice Creek Cocoa Krispies. We need them. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Because we need it to be chocolate. Did we literally just use the whole box? Oh well. <laughs> I don't know what's happening in the kitchen right now. Uh, you should have known this was going to happen when you hit me. But you were like, Oh, this is just cakes and conversation. It's no big deal. <laughs> it's gonna be easy. We don't need food coloring. We, don't, we can handle all the bad jokes that we'll hear today. Squirrel! This will literally be the longest episode we've ever put together. But the most funnerest. Oh, most funnerest ever. Get to know people before you... Before you go off and... Make your, er, make your opinion. How can someone get to know you, Aaron? Talk to me. Ask me in a nice way, you know, about stuff. Sometimes, you know, you ask about, about other stuff and that might lead to the questions about me, why I'm different. I, I don't want to be like, um, I'm, I don't want to be, I'm not m my disabilities, if that makes any sense to you. Makes a lot of sense. So what are you? What do you want to be known for? Being funny, being kind to people, being a Christian. This is, this is like a, an endorsement for insulin. <laughs> Our unpaid sponsor, Insulin. <laughs> I hope you're getting this part because just 
Let me warn you, some of my best materials yet to come. <laughs> you have a diagnosis that I could not pronounce earlier. Can you tell me about that? Well, I tried the hydra... Hydrocephalus. That's it. Yeah, tell me about that. It means water on the brain. But a little trick, it's actually not water, or I don't know if it's water, but it's called cerebral spinal fluid. I was born with too much of it on the brain. You're supposed to have it, but I have shunts in my brain that I think were put in at birth. I don't remember how many shunts I have, but they, they drain the water from my brain or cerebral spinal fluid. What are some of the things that are challenging because of that diagnosis? I wouldn't say afraid, but uh, I'm a little cautious about doing, you know, outside sports and stuff because I might hit my head and, you know, cause a lot, a lot of trouble. But, you know, I don't just sit in a chair and worry and I don't want to not live. I thought you said it was supposed to be a squirrel. It is going to be a squirrel. You and I are going to make it a squirrel. I don't know how to shape a squirrel, but well, that's why we're here. You can test it. See how the cocos taste. Oh gosh. Squirrely. Squirrel. <laughs> What are some other challenges? Can you, can the camera see uh -huh. this? Uh -huh. I have no thumbs and I have joint laxity, so writing it is very hard. I, I will even write stuff down and not be able to read my own writing later. Like that, as I'm writing it, I can read it, but somehow it turns into gibberish in the process. Yeah. How does that make you feel? Frustrated. I noticed that your head will tilt over to the side. I don't know why. You don't? Just nervous habit, I guess. Is it more comfortable? I, I really don't know. Um, people have asked me about that before, but it's really hard when it's a question about yourself that you can't answer. It, it makes it hard. Yeah, now we're not gonna be eating butter wrapper and Cocoa Crispy box. So just dump it? Or? Yeah, just put it in there. As long as you get all that paper off. Good night. Now this guy in the kitchen, he's adding his own special ingredient. <laughs> Triple check. That mar those marshmallows are like, hi, but where are the others? <laughs> all right, I'll take that. Yes, I'll take this. <laughs> And you go ahead and just mix this <laughs> up right here. I hope you're getting this. It's like an 80s band, but like <laughs> Devo. You can dance if you want to. You, you can leave this world behind. behind. But if your friends, friends don't, don't dance, and if they don't dance, dance with well, her, no friends of mine. You said that you had two diagnoses this is hydrocephalus, and what's the other one? actually have three. Hydrocephalus, seizures, and joint laxity. The latest trigger is like strobe lights. But the joint laxity is why I have the AFOs. Do they help? Yes. Okay, that one, gosh. Okay, this one's gonna be a little extra crunchy. So sometimes in the kitchen, people like to measure, and this is why. Treat us like they would you, or is that Asher? 
you know, we may not have our thumbs or, you know, we don't like it when you look at us like we have 14 eyeballs or, you know, get to know us, you know, just talk to us about stuff. We're, we are not our, our issues. You know, we like baseball or, you know, trivia or reading computers just like you do. So, I mean, if you want to know something about our issues, that's okay. But, the, like I said before, there's a right way and a wrong way to ask about it. You know, get to know us. We're just like you. All right, so Aaron, before we touch it, we have to put butter on our hands. So what you want to do is I'm going to get, like I just pinched some butter, pinch a little, just a little bit of butter. So is this why they call people butterfingers? Yes, exactly. It started right here in the kitchen. Here. How do you like this? You tell me, man. I love it. <laughs> What's the best part about being an uncle? Just being with my nieces and nephews, and sometimes I'll come home from dads, and you know, I won't even get settled down, and my nieces and nephews will be all over me. Oh, Uncle Aaron, you're, you're home. And, you know, I, I got this and this and this to show you. And, you know, if a kid wants you, they're the most important thing right at that moment. They need to know that. You want to shape this? into kind of like the shape of that mouth, which it could just be an oval. You could do an oval. So oval. like this. Oval. Egg? Yeah, shape. egg shape. Make an egg shape out of that. And then I'll do the parts that add I, up to the top. I, I like words, so, so, so I, I like, um, you know, etymologies and, uh -huh. and relating it to different things. So I was like, oh, Egg. Does that help you when you're learning? Mm -hmm. Do you want to live on your own? I want to, but I'd love to have a, a girlfriend and get married, but... I don't know what's going to happen, obviously. What's a dating life look like? No dates right now. What are you looking for in a girl? First off, a Christian, sweet, you know, doesn't look at me as my disabilities. Um, hopefully local in, in some way. What do you think marriage is like? I think it's tough sometimes because you're living in the same place with the same person for how many ever hours a day, every day. And I think marriage is a lot tougher right now because of quarantine. And, but I think it takes strong people to be married to each other. But I think it's fun sometimes. So what we're gonna do is grab these and let's make eyes out of them. We made an awesome squirrel cake and I felt great about it. <laughs> what was your favorite part? I'll just goof it off with you and yeah. telling my story and I hope uh, everybody makes the cake and just has fun with it.
If you like the squirrel and you love hanging out with Aaron today, would you like this video? Share it with somebody. Hit that subscribe button. Not only that, we'll put up a couple videos at the end if you want to watch another video of Cakes and Conversations. And we believe that every creation is beautiful and everyone deserves to be treated like royalty. So let's start treating. We'll see you in the kitchen. Thanks for watching today and we'll see you in the kitchen.